हेलो गाइस टुडेज आवर टॉपिक इज ऑल अबाउट माइकोलॉजी सो नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू डिफाइन द टर्म माइकोलॉजी माइकोलॉजी इज अ स्टडी ऑफ फंजाई एंड इंक्लूडिंग देयर जेनेटिक एंड बायोकेमिकल प्रॉपर्टीज माइकोलॉजी कम्स फ्रॉम एन इंसेंट ग्रीक वर्ड्स कॉल मशरूम्स now the structure of the fungi the fungi are either single celled or multicellular and uh, it has a cell wall which made up of chitin chitin is nothing but a fibrous structure which consists of a polysaccharides and uh, almost all fungi have a filamentous structure except the yeast cells except the yeast cells uh, all the fungi have the filamentous structure the nucleus is also present in the fungi which is dense clear with chromatin threads like structure and uh, the nucleus is surrounded by a nuclear membrane it uh, consist of a long thread like a structure called hypha called hypha here a uh, here is a simple structure of the fungi so i want uh, um, to uh, discuss little bit about the fungi in this diagram here this is the hypha this is the hypha 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 is nothing but uh, it's a, a structure which absorb nutrients from the environment and uh, it extend into the food sources this is the food sources here the hypha extends up to the food sources and it release enzyme that break the food so it can be absorb their foods through the cell walls and uh, <coughs> now this is the spores this is spores spores is a microscopic particles which help the fungus to reproduce this is the sporangium this is sporangium where the spores are formed in this area the spores are formed now here the examples of the fungi like yeasts yeasts is a unicellular fungi mold is a multicellular fungi and mushrooms is a macroscopic filamentous fungi this yeast is a uh, uh, the exception which is not the filamentous fungi now i am going to uh, shift in the next uh, hmm, topic like uh, characteristics of the fungi the fungi is a eukaryotic non vascular non motile and heterotrophic organism eukaryotic means a true nucleus are present in the fungi non vascular this the xylem and phloem are absent in the fungi so uh, they depend they uh, can't make their foods so it's depend upon the other organism and other host cells that's why it's also called as the heterotrophic organism and it uh, is not uh, movable it uh, can't move fungi is a unicellular or filamentous uh, structure it uh, reproduce by the spores i already discuss in the previous space now in fungi the chlorophyll are absent so it cannot be perform photosynthesis 
the cell wall contain the chitin which is uh, which is a fibrous uh, structure that consists of the polysaccharides here the cytoplasmic membranes contains the ergosteroids the ergo what is ergosteroids ergosteroids is the steroid pro precursor of the vitamin d and it's a function like a cholesterol fungi is a sexual and asexual organism and uh, it is more serious and uh, causes fetal diseases fetal disease means uh, the it capable of causing death of the organism and uh, the fungi is a uh, facultative and aerobes now i am going to tell about the nourishment of the fungi the fungi absorbs their nutrients from the environment and uh, almost all fungi are chemoheterotrophs and it is a uh, saprophytes saprophytes means uh, it uh, uh, digest it uh, get digest dead organic matter and uh, they take their nutrients their food from the dead organic matter the parasite it is it is also a parasitic organism parasites means uh, it uh, obtain their nutrients from the host cells or other organism and uh, it grow in high salt and sugar area and uh, the ph lower than 5 to 9 units so guys here some important uh, terms like eukaryotes so eukaryotes means cells uh, ha which have a nucleus and other organelles enclosed by the plasma membrane here non vascular means uh, without vascular system like lack of xylem and phloem ergosterol means esterol on a cell membranes that acts to maintain the cell membrane integrity the fetal motor lethal deadly this all means same that uh, capable th this means the capable of uh, causing death of the organism this is the sporangium sporangium means uh, the spores are formed and it composed of a single cell or multicellular organism hyphae means uh, hy hypha absorb nutrients from environment and it uh, extend into food source and release enzymes that enzyme break the food and absorb through the cell wall thank you so much i hope you like my video like please like share and subscribe my video